Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Jordan, if you do not follow me already. I am 23 years old, I just turned 23 in May, so it's like a new, it's a new age for me. We're, we're still learning 23. I live in New York City. Um, I work at the Food Network on their digital video teams. So today I'm gonna do a week in my life video for you guys because you guys seem to really like them. So it's Monday morning, I got ready. I actually just spent the weekend in the Hamptons. If you wanna see like fun pictures and stuff from that, you can follow me on Instagram. I'm just doing my makeup right now. You guys know I do a very, very, very simple work makeup routine, which I will have linked down below for you guys if you wanna check out that video. Um, I'm just bronzing up my face right now. I want to talk to you guys about something really, really exciting. So the lease on this apartment is coming up at the end of August. It's just about the beginning of July. It's like the end of August, June right now. I am doing something I never thought I would do, at least not this soon, but I am moving to Brooklyn and I'm really, really super excited about it. I think it's going to be a really, really nice change for me. I do really like Manhattan and I think that this is like a really fun, obviously exciting place to be, but Brooklyn is definitely cheaper, definitely quieter, and I'm excited to kind of have like the best of both worlds. And I'm also really excited to do moving vlogs for you guys because I love watching moving vlogs. Okay, so I'm done with my makeup. Thank God, I literally hate doing my makeup in the morning. Also, my desk is like so messy right now. Um, for my hair, my new thing is I go to bed with my hair wet. I put it in a braid and then when I wake up in the morning, I just wet the ends of it so the ends aren't like super crunchy and it just ends up looking like really nice, pretty like natural looking waves. Um, now I will show you guys my outfit for the day. Okay, so for my outfit today, I'm wearing this super cute, really, really comfy jean skirt from Zara. It's like one of my favorites. Um, and then I'm wearing this really cute little striped work top. This is what I call these, but they're more just like button-up blouses. From ASOS, I really like it. I like the contrast and stuff. And then I'm just wearing these little white Adidas sneakers. So that's my outfit today. Pretty simple, but it's cute. Okay, I'm gonna go brush my teeth and then I'm gonna make breakfast and then I have to head out the door and I'll show you guys like how I get to work, I guess. Could be exciting. Hi guys, this is my boss Tina. She's never been in the video before, but she's a big fan of YouTube. And me. And you. And my channel. So we're going to get lunch. We're going to Sweet Green, which is just a little walk from our office. And the line at Sweet Green is always really long, so we'll see how long it is today. I'm going to guess we're going to be waiting for 20 minutes. I'm going to guess it's out the door. You think it's going to be out the door? Yeah. Alyssa? You guys have met Alyssa before. How long do you think the line's going to be? Oh, uh, probably to the door. Okay. Well, we'll see when we get there. just got back from my day after work I had dance class on Mondays me and my friend Katie who is gonna be my future roommate take a Broadway dance class down in Fide Eye it's really fun um, today was actually I'm usually like really really bad at it but today was a really good day and I actually like got all the dances so that was really fun and next week is actually our last week so it was fun it always is a good time so I'm just boiling up some water here to make some pasta for dinner. It's already like nine, I'm so tired. Um, I'm gonna make this red lentil pasta from Trader Joe's, which I really like. All right, here's my dinner in all of its glory. It doesn't look that pretty, but it's literally 9.30 and I'm so tired. It's just red lentil pasta, zucchini, red sauce, and a little bit of nutritional yeast on top. Oh, I'm gonna eat this, and then I'm getting in the shower, and then I will see you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, I just got home from work. It is Tuesday. Sorry I didn't vlog this morning, but my morning this morning was just pretty similar to yesterday's morning. But I went to the grocery store after work, so I just figured I would show you guys what I got because I love watching grocery hauls. Also, like, 
what I look like on a day after work. I did purposely do my hair like this today because I, I thought it went cute with my, my fit, but not looking so hot after a full day of work. Either way, here is what I got. So the first thing that I picked up was a kombucha, Brew Doctor kombucha, and this is the Love flavor, which I think is lavender, so I'm excited to try this. I love kombucha. It's like my favorite thing. Then I got, oh, I usually go to Trader Joe's, but today I tried to do Fairway, which is just like a no local, like normal restaurant, like stop and shop-esque, like every brand you could think of, normal grocery store. Because I wanted to just, I wanted something new. And if you guys live in New York City, you know that Trader Joe's is like a crazy madhouse. And sometimes I just don't have the energy for that. This is the Khalifa Farms Unsweetened Vanilla Almond Milk. Um, no sugar added. I love this almond milk and they don't sell it at Trader Joe's, I don't think. So I was excited to get that today. Then I got two kinds of popsicles because I love snacking on popsicles like after dinner in the summertime. I got these Chloe's Pops Dark Chocolate Popsicles, which Chloe's is a Froyo-esque yogurt dessert place in the city they're basically like fruit froyos that are like healthy and i had never tried her like popsicles or pre-made stuff before so i went to get this and the ingredients are just water dark chocolate puree which is bananas cocoa processed with alkali and natural cocoa and a little bit of cane sugar so i'm excited about these and then i also got these coconut lime good pops which are dairy free and the ingredients in these are just coconut cream water lime juice, a little bit of agave nectar, coconut, um, and then sea salt and vanilla extract. So I'm excited about these. I got some organic peanut butter. When I'm buying peanut butter, I always, always make sure that it's just peanuts and salt in the ingredients. I don't want any extra oil or any extra other ingredients, just peanuts and sea salt. So that is what I got. One sweet potato, three green apples. Then I got broccoli, and a red bell pepper, and an avocado, and some kale. Last bag, which is like the most fun bag because it has all the good stuff in it. I got some olives from like the, how like they have like the pre-made bar, like, you know the pre-section? Mmm. I love olives so much. Then I got these, um, this, which I'm excited about. It's the Capello's paleo friendly gluten-free grain-free vegan chocolate chip cookie dough now this like really can't be that yummy <laughs> the ingredients are almond flowers maple syrup some dark chocolate arrowroot flour coconut oil sea salt and baking soda like i can't imagine this tastes as good as normal cookie dough but i've been seeing it and i really wanted to give it a try so i got it then I just got some tri-colored quinoa because I want to do like a quinoa sweet potato kale salad a la a harvest bowl from Sweet Green. Then I got my favorite crackers which are the Simply Mills rosemary and sea salt almond flour crackers. So good and to eat with those I got some of the chow um field roast chow vegan slices that is my grocery haul um but now we're gonna make dinner and then we're gonna go all eat together so that's it. Wednesday morning I just got ready and I'm going to head off to work I'm actually on time today so I'm not gonna spend too much time vlogging or else that would make me late once again but I'm just gonna show you guys what I'm wearing to work today and then I'm gonna head off to the office and I have some really fun plans tonight which I'm excited about I have a happy hour and I'm also going to see Jonathan Van Ness tonight at Caroline's on Broadway and I'm so excited like I love Queer Eye I love JVN I feel like he is he, I don't feel like, I know that him and I would be such good friends and I just love him and I'm so excited to see his show tonight because I think he's going to bring out some special guests and I'm excited about it. So I also really like my outfit today because as you heard I have huge plans so I need to look really cute. So here's what I'm wearing. Levi's jeans, these are the wedgie fits and then I'm just wearing these cute little slide shoes. They're white and pointed. I'm obsessed with them. I think they're just like so chic and so cool. Then I am wearing this bodysuit from Reformation with a little white t-shirt underneath. That's like my go-to trick for dressing appropriately for work. 
um, because this is a super cute bodysuit and looks like so amazing on its own, but it's just a little too risque for work, so I always like putting a white t-shirt underneath. That's what I did with that jumpsuit yesterday, and it's just a really, really cute look and makes it work appropriate super easily. This is my outfit, and then for my hair, I've been doing this a lot lately. I just have it have some texture on the bottom with a braid at night and then a little top knot at the top. I just think it's like summery and cute. Gives like a fun little addition to an outfit. So that is what I'm wearing today. And I'm so excited to take you guys along on today's little adventure because it's going to be really, really fun. It's a week in my life. This is Hannah. Yeah, we'll come with like different kinds of ice cream. He's not in it. Oh, sorry. Hi. Tell them what they need to hear. The key to a good margarita is no salt. That is a lie. Don't a lie. listen to her. The key to margarita is salt on the rim. Lots of salt. Hey guys. So um, after, oh shoot, my hand. So after work, me and Rachel went to happy hour for our coworker, Lauren, who's leaving. Last day, yeah. And now we're at dinner. And then after this, I'm going to JVN, which I'll be FaceTiming Rachel throughout the whole experience. Yeah, because I was too slow. And tickets sold out in like five minutes and I missed it, but upsetting. It's fine. I know. Um, but yeah, we're about to eat at this place called Dez. Yeah, it's super in, fun. In Nolita. Good morning, guys. Oh my god, I am so tired. Last night after dinner. Me and my friend and coworker Elise went to go see Jonathan Van Ness at Caroline's on Broadway in New York, and it was really fun. Um, it was an interesting show. I don't really know what to like take of it. I thought it was gonna be him doing sort of like a sound interview style Q and A situation, but it was stand up, and he was the host. So there were three stand up people. And he was like the host of the show, which is like totally fine. Like I really like stand up. And one of my favorite comedians, stand up comedians who I've seen before, Greta Titelman was there, who I'm obsessed with. She also does a podcast called Lady Lovin' with Jilly Hendrix and Lo Bosworth. I'm like obsessed with her. You guys have to follow her on Instagram. She's so funny. But the show wasn't until 10, so I didn't get home until like... 12 30 and then I didn't go to bed until like 1 or like 1 30 so I'm just freaking exhausted right now I've legitimately no idea what I want to wear like I've legitimately no idea when I'm gonna get up out of this bed um I haven't made lunch yet like I can't afford to not make lunch because it's so expensive to buy lunch so I'm gonna have to do that there's just like a ton of things that I haven't done yet and I'm still just here on my phone watching Taylor Hill do her makeup on IGTV all right I'm gonna get ready for work let's see how long it's gonna take me it's 8.42 did you guys get any of that I said let's help see let's see how long it's gonna take me it's 8.42 maybe I'll be out of here at 9.20 40 minutes peace Okay guys, it is Thursday after work and I'm at and I'm at dinner. <laughs> and I'm at dinner with my cousins Jenna and Julia. <laughs> yeah, I'll put it in there. You're exposing me. Do you want to be do you not want to be exposed? No, I don't care. Totally okay, fine. either way. <laughs> I won't name for your fan base. No, I should though. Jordan, Rebecca, or No. Yes. We'll think of something better than that. Yeah, um Jenna's here from um, LA for like a month and a half. A month. And we're here for dinner with my other cousin, Maya. Hey. <laughs> Maya's in from Philly. She's staying with me tonight. We're gonna have a sleepover. I'm not invited. You're not invited. Yeah. Well, you can't be invited. We have to drop her off by 10.30. Yeah. I can't wait to get our food. It's gonna be a good time. I'm drinking wine. Jenna's drinking water. It's gonna be great. I'm, I'm just exposing you. I love her. Oh, yes. Okay, so we just got some um, hummus and interesting seed crackers. Oh, I didn't tell you guys where we are. I've actually showed this to you guys in a vlog before, but we're at Cafe Clover. I've been here for brunch a lot. It's really good. Hummus? Not hummus. It's like a healthy restaurant in the West Village. Really good. Hummus? Not hummus. It's like chia seeds stuck together with egg whites. 
We got some bok choy with um, goji, berries. goji berries and cashew. A loaded sweet potato with like mushrooms and other cauliflower. I don't think so. And then roasted carrots, which look bomb. And then a cute little girl named Jenna. Oh wait, it's not focused. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh yeah, yeah, there it is. We all got our meals. I got chickpea pasta. I got a vegan hamburger. Maya calls on real cauliflower steak. It was so effing good. It's gonna be so hot today in New York City, like 95 degrees. I don't even truly know what I'm gonna do with myself. And I feel like I might have already showed you guys this outfit. Like, I think I might have worn this on Monday. I honestly don't remember correctly. <laughs> um, but I'm wearing. You did? That's hysterical. I don't think I did. I'm wearing this green dress from Reformation with like a white tank underneath because work appropriate. And some sneakers. This is my look. This is Maya's look. Gorge. And yeah, we're ready to take on the day. We are truly ready to take on the day. Right? Yeah. Hey guys, so we're back. It's Friday. It's mid work day, but we're treating ourselves again to lunch. So we're here with Tina and Lizzie. And we're at Serafina in Meatpacking District. And yeah, just like a treat yourself Friday. Guys, we survived. Um, I ate dinner. I went then went to Press Juicery, which is my favorite effing place to get um, like healthy ice cream. Their Press Freeze is so freaking good. I go, I get vanilla Press Freeze, which is like literally made out of like four ingredients. It's so good. There's a lot of like healthy ice cream situations here in New York, and Press is definitely my favorite. So I get the vanilla thing with salt, um, almond butter on top, and then the dark chocolate chips. And it's so good, you guys. So good. Um, but yeah, that is it for this vlog. I'm literally just going to sit here watch Southern Charm on my computer, um, which is like one of my favorite Bravo shows. I'm like a Bravo show, reality show fanatic. So I'm going to watch that, start editing this video, and that's it. And then I'm going to start my weekend. I actually don't have that many plans for this weekend, but... It's a really tiring week, so I think I'm just going to go to bed. Um, but yeah, that's it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. If you want to see more vlogs, you can find them right here. And if you want to subscribe, you can click here. Um, thank you guys so much. Have a great weekend. I love you, and happy 4th of July. Bye.